Hello students, in my previous video, I have told you that whenever a chemical reaction takes place, we observe some changes. These changes either may be change in state or change in color or evolution of a gas or change in temperature. Today, we will learn how to express chemical reaction in the form of chemical equations. You must have learned about equations in maths. Today we will learn chemical equations. In activity 1.1, I have told you that when we burn magnesium ribbon in the presence of air, it convert into magnesium oxide. This description of a chemical reaction in a sentence form is quite long. It can be written in a shorter form. The simplest way to do is to write it in the form of a word equation. The word equation for the above reaction would be magnesium plus oxygen. arrow headed towards the magnesium oxide. The substances that undergo chemical change are magnesium and oxygen and such type of substances are known as reactants. So what are the reactants? Reactants are the substances which undergo chemical change in a reaction are known as reactant. What are reactants in this reaction? Oxygen and magnesium are the reactant. The new substance is magnesium oxide and this is known as product. So, the product products are the new substances which are formed during the reaction. In this reaction, the product is magnesium oxide. Always keep in your mind that in a chemical reaction, we can take one or more reactant as well as in a chemical reaction one or more products may be formed. So in this example we have taken two reactants and by combination of these two reactants one product is formed. A word equation shows change of reactants to products through an arrow placed between them. Can you observe this arrow? This arrow the reactants are written on the left hand side with a plus sign between them. Very important. The reactants are written on the left hand side with a plus sign between them. Similarly, the products are written on the right hand side with a plus sign between them. The arrow is headed the arrow head points towards the products and shows the direction of the reaction what is mean by direction of the reaction direction of the reaction means that these are the reactants which we have taken initially are converting into the products so this is the direction of a 
reaction. Now we will learn how to write a chemical equation. This type of reactions in which we use the name of the reactants and products are known as word equation. Word equation. We can express these word equation into symbolic form. Now we will learn how to write a chemical equation in the form of symbols. Is there any other shorter way for representing chemical equations? Chemical equations can be made more concise and useful if we use chemical formula instead of words. A chemical equation represent a chemical reaction. This chemical reaction, a chemical equation represents a chemical reaction. Can you recall the formula of magnesium oxygen and magnesium oxide? Yes, then we will be right to a symbolic equation in place of this word equation. Look at here, magnesium plus oxygen gives magnesium oxide. Now count and compare the number of atoms of each element on the left hand side and right hand side of the arrow. The number of magnesium atom is 1 and number of magnesium atom is also 1 at product side. But the number of oxygen atom at reactant side are 2 and number of oxygen atom at product side is 1. So we can conclude that the number of atoms of each element are not equal to both of the sides. That means the equation is not balanced. This type of equation is known as unbalanced equation because the mass is not the same on both the sides. The mass is not same it both the sides of the equation. Such a chemical equation is a skeleton chemical equation for a reaction. Chemical equation is a skeletal chemical equation for a reaction. So, we can say that this equation is the skeletal chemical equation for the burning of magnesium in air. And this equation is the word equation for burning of magnesium ribbon in the air. Now, can you differentiate between word equation and skeletal equation? 